Hello guys, welcome to the aftermath of um, uh, Roadblock. And I'll be honest, I'm actually a little bit more after this baby was impressed. Um, I had an enjoyable evening. I don't know actually about you guys. I'm, um, I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit. I'll be, I'll be honest, guys. You know that my condition is well. I have a very high blood pressure, but after the night, my God, I thank God I don't have to go to medical exams tomorrow morning because <laughs> my blood pressure will go through the roof, especially after Sasha Banks and uh, um, and Charlotte. My God, what an evening! I, I don't know where you guys stand, but. Wow! <laughs> um, I didn't see everything because yeah, you have to. This guy's you have to sell stand for me it's night time. I'll try my best. Um, now Rusev, uh, let, let me go with results and give a little bit of my thoughts about the matches what I saw. Rusev beat uh, Big Cass on the count out. I felt serious. Uh, this was, I had something, my god, this, this pay-per-view is... Sorry, for it feel badly, if, you, if you're starting off like this, I know the kick-up messages are not always that best, it's a little bit la-la-la, but this, I mean, seriously. But then again, it maybe fits perfectly, you know, in the storyline, so yeah, maybe. We have new tag team champions, Seamus and Cesaro, uh, be the new day. Congratulations. But it's so typical, you know, every time a record has been broken with titles, seriously, um, then the day or the next after really concerning match, it is their lose. You, you can almost guarantee it. It's a little bit, I don't know. Uh, Sami Zayn made it to the 10 minutes. Okay, congratulations. Sam Rollins uh, defeated Chris Jericho. Uh, I was actually impressed by this match, what I saw of it. Uh, Rick Swan retained, and after that, Phil Neville, ret oh, Phil ne Neville returned. Phil Neville is a football player. My God, seriously. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Neville uh, attacked uh, Rick Swan. He's probably enjoy uh, joining the the cruiserweight. <sighs> oh, sorry, guys. Um, it, it is uh, at least five o'clock in the night, so you have to think about it. You know what I'm doing. Um, Actually, now it's sound starting to building up that cruiser way. Yeah, you know, I hope it brings you something. And then the Iron Man match. And now something, now okay, let's see. But if if I'm correct, I think that Sasha and uh, Charlotte, Charlotte, especially Sasha, uh, she botched a lot of moves. I was really like, what are you doing, girl? But the emotion, you could feel the emotion and the time ticking down, you know, tick, tick, tick. And uh, for myself, my God, after 10 minutes, one nil to Charlie, I thought to myself, my God, are we going to see this again? And um, then Sasha made a draw, then came two one ahead. And then I had something. If I was her, if you really want to be champ, if you really have something going, I would not tap. You know, those three seconds. Problem is, of course, and I noticed that also when I was doing judo, and uh, you have to understand this a little bit. Even it seems a few seconds, every second feels like a minute. Uh, that comes down to so it it's such an emotional roller coaster, and, and a second can feel like a minute. And that, that yeah, my God, I was really, I was, I thought to myself, Sasha, what are the fuck are you doing here? Yes, I you still word fuck, but whatever. Um, 
I have something. Really? Are you serious? See? I thought to myself, my God, you know? And, you know, and even Sasha started to, to, I don't know what she did, what happened. Sasha son was bleeding. She got a major blood, uh, uh, blood nose and uh, of, uh, bleeding from her nose. She, she was bleeding. I thought to myself, they're going to stop this match. They're going to stop this match. They're not allowed to bleed in WWE. And, and nothing happened. I thought to myself, what the f Hmm? What is going on here? And uh, yeah. And finally, my, my blood pressure in the sudden death, I'll be honest, I could feel my blood racing <laughs> through my veins. I thought to myself, seriously, you know, and I, the emotion was getting to me. It was really, I had something, wow. You know, and that made me. This ma that match, the Iron Man match, made for me the the um, the pay per view. I'll, I'll be strictly honest. It felt so good. It was so much emotion. It was beautiful done. I'll I'll, I'll be honest about that, man, guys. And um, yeah, I don't know what you think. And and then I thought to myself. So, um, Roman Reigns came against uh, uh, Kevin Owens. Sorry, I, I couldn't get on his name. You know, it happens. And um, the story was that before, back before the match, I think it was before uh, the 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 Iron Man match. She uh, they got on the the story was told that. Chris Jericho's locker room door was closed and and he was pounding and he was saying actually goodbye to his friendship and it was so emotional. I thought to myself, poor guy. I, I felt even sorry for that guy. And you have in your mind, you know how this goes. And I was waiting for it to be swerved. I know, I thought, there's going to happen something. And um, I thought to myself, is going to happen. This doesn't. It feels so strange. You know, they're, they're pounding too much on. He's saying goodbye to his friend. I thought to myself, yeah, you don't fucking trick me. You know, you don't do that. And um, I came down. I thought to myself, yeah, of course, you know. And I thought, no, they're not going to play anymore on it anyway. They let Roman Reigns win. And suddenly, Chris Jericho came up. And he put uh, the the lions, no, the code breaker on uh, Kevin Owens. I thought to myself, okay, now we're going to build up the WrestleMania match. You know, we're going to start WrestleMania, slow build up between Kevin Owens and Chris Jericho. And suddenly he had the title. I thought to myself, oh my god. And, And Roman Reigns was out or something. And then suddenly, Seth Rollins came out. I thought to myself, hmm. Hmm. And now I'm always thinking outside the box. And I think, they sh should you do a reunion? No. But what if Triple H joins forces with Kevin Owens and Chris Jericho to take on The Shield? Now, I know it's far-fetched, but you could do it, and there you could build on two matches. You could actually build two matches for the Royal Rumble. Let these guys go at it. Because then you can build up Triple H against Seth Rollins, and Kevin Owens against Chris Jericho. And let that build, to build up. I'm not saying it will be like that. I'm not saying it is going to be like that. But if I was creative, I would do it. You could easily do it, you know. <laughs> then, for example, Chris Jericho say, let's bring in Triple H and, and blah, blah, blah. He's a mentor. You know, like really strong team and blah, blah, blah. And then they blame each other, you know. That's how you can build up. It is not that... It's not rocket science, you know, and let the friendship upload from there. 
because now we're swerved. But then again, you make an extra swerve. That's how I would build up WrestleMania. If it's going to be happening, that's another question. Uh, if I'm being honest, going to happen like that, I know WWE, but I doubt it. And that would be a shame. Um, well, guys, this is actually also the last aftermath of the year. So, um, enjoy it while it lasts. <laughs> My name is Janja Bavink. Uh, I'm the owner of GTA Sports Studio. Uh, this is from the YouTube channel GTA Live. Um, I'll be back tomorrow with the GTA show. And uh, we're going today. It's going to be today. It's 10 minutes past 5. Uh, but I've buy it in America. I'll be tomorrow there. Have a nice evening. I hope you enjoyed uh, WW Roadblock as I did. Let me know what your thoughts about the pay-per-view were. And uh, I hope to hear from you. See ya.